Good day! In this video, we are going to try to solve question 3C or the final questions of the 2021 NCA Level 3 Probability Distribution Method. So, without further ado, let's read the question. It's a long question. It's only a one question. It's an excellence question and this is a justification type of question. Another company developed an operating system named System C. The company is fairly sure that they have developed System C so that the time for a serious system error to occur is longer on average than the other operating system, the A, W and L. For System C, the time of serious system error to occur is an average or the mean of 6.25 years with a standard deviation of 0.8. Details of a sample of 800 computers that develop a serious error are sent to the company. The distribution and summary statistics for the time for the serious system error after purchase for this sample are shown below. This is the graph and this is the 5 point summary, the minimum, lower quartile, median, upper quartile and the upper quartile. Upper quartile and the maximum, sorry. <coughs> and the numbers are given here. Justify the use of normal distribution with a mean of 6.25 years and standard deviation of 0.8 to model the time to serious error after purchase for system C. Okay, so it sounds very complicated, but it is not. So you need to justify whether this graph or this statistic justify the use of system C for the normal distribution. So uh, my answer will be the normal distribution would be a appropriate model for the time to serious error after purchase of system C because first, the center, if you look at the center, the mean is 6.236 and the median is 6.246. So in a normal distribution, the mean and the median are very close or very uh, similar or the same. So that's why it's a good point that they are a good model for the normal distribution. The second point is, the graph or the graph shape of the graph looks like more like a bell shape. It is like a normal distribution. It is bell shape. It is unimodal. There's only one mode and it is symmetrical on both sides of the graph. So they, this graph looks like a normal distribution. The third point is the, the very little data is found outside 3 SD about the mean. Okay, So if you know your statistics, 1 SD is 68%. 2SD is 95% and 3SD is 99%. In this case, 99% of the data lies within 3 standard deviation, which we calculated. Mean plus 3 standard deviation is 6.236. The mean is 6.236. And 3 standard deviation plus 3 times 0 0.8, because the standard deviation is 0 0.8. So all the data, 99% of the data lies within 3.9 and 8.56 years. So 99%, there's very few data, only 1% of the data lies outside the three standard deviation. So you only need two, uh, two points to justify normal division. I give you three, so you choose which one you are more comfortable with. So in your exam, you can argue your case, justify the case. If you can do that, that will be an E, excellent in this paper, or E7. If you get one excellent in E7, you get two excellent, you get E8. So go through this paper again, do question 1A all the way to 3C and see whether you can ace this NCA uh, probability distribution paper. I don't think it's too difficult. Have a go at it again and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers everyone and have a good day.